Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So this is serving class part 4. So as per our discussions yesterday, we said that we'll be discussing the further MCQs. So, first MCQ is the double line field book is commonly used for recording what? Already we have discussed what is a field book. So as per that, field book is used for recording the chain line measurements and it is from bottom to upwards everything we discussed and we said that two types of books are there double line and single line so double line is used for common civil works that is single survey works so ordinary or simple survey chain works we use this double line field book next question for a triangle at the earth surface having an area of 195 meters square or 195.5 the difference between the sum of angles in a plane triangle and spherical triangle. We studied this clearly in geodetic surveying. Uh, we will be getting two triangles that is in the uh, from the earth surface. If we consider the earth surface that is called geodetic surveying. So from that we will understand that there is a plane triangle and there is a spherical triangle. So the difference should be what we have studied clearly. One second for every 195.5 meter square of area. Next question. Survey carried out to fix the boundary of a building site. We have studied this. I said now this boundary or property. Anything will come. That answer will be cadastral survey. Next question. The survey conducted to obtain design a project. Whatever the balance, you don't want to consider that designing related, I said already, engineering survey it should be. Next question is, yes, the basic principle of surveying is for working from, what is the basic principle? We discussed it, working from whole to part. Next is a problematic question. The plan of a map was photocopied to a reduced size such that a line originally 100 mm. It was originally 100 mm and measures 90 mm. The original plane, uh, original scheme or scale of the plan is 1 is to 1000. That is, original scale is given to you that is 1 is to 1000. It is said that it was 100 mm. But accidentally they measured it as 90 mm. So what is the actual error happened there? 90 by 100. So when you cut you will get the answer 0 0.9. So you want to know what is the revised scale. What happened is so for 1 is to also for 1 this is 1000. So for 0.9 what happened? So for 0.9 divided by 1000. So that will be if you want to change the decimal, you will multiply by 10 and multiply, divide by 10. So you will get the answer 9 by 10,000. It will be 1 by 1, 1, 1, 1 point something. But as it is a scale, we don't consider that. We will write as 1 is to 1, 1, 1, 1. This will be in the option. You can select it like that. Clear it is. So for 1, thousand is there. So what is the error here? Point nine. So for point nine, what it is? So that is the revised scale. Now, next question is a ground area of 112 meter square represented by 4.5 centimeter square on plan. What is the representative fraction? We studied what is representative fraction. Representative fraction is actually map distance by ground distance that everybody know when a map distance is given and a ground distance is given directly you can uh, find the ratio and you can write the answer but here distance is not given distance so both are distance distance is not given here map distance by ground distance distance is not given then what is given instead instead they have given the area so what we have to do first we have to make this into same scale then whenever area is given, whenever area is given, 
the obtained RF, you have to take the square root. If it was length, you can directly write that. But area means the obtained representative fraction, you have to take the square root. And if it is a cube, the obtained representative fraction, you have to take the cube root. Why it is happening? Because already we have studied true length is what ratio of wrong scale by original uh, correct scale into measured length. But when I'm talking about true area, it will be wrong scale or uh, by correct scale, the whole square into measured area. So this area is became square to find the true area. Okay, so that is why for finding this true, uh, for finding this R of back, we have to take the square root. If it is cube, you know, true volume as we have studied last class, this cube into measured volume. So whenever we want to find if cube, cubical measurement is given for finding R of, you have to take the cube root. This is the explanation of that. Okay, so you understood uh, how that uh, square root comes. So the representative fraction here is square root of the map area by the ground area. That is, what is the map area given? Square root of map area is 4.5 4.5 centimeter square divided by 112.5. That this is in centimeter square and this is in meter square. So how we will convert meter square into centimeter square? Multiplied by 100 into 100. If you multiply by 100, it will become only centimeter. You want it centimeter square. So that is why you are multiplying with 200. Okay. So as this both decimals are there, we can cancel out the decimal. And 45, how many times in 112.5? When you divide and say, you will get the answer 25. So, what is the square root of 2, 2, 5, 0, 0, 0, 0, you got the answer 1 by 2, 5, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, the square root. That is, what is the square root of 25? You know, it is 5. So, 1 by 5. Then, out of this 4 zeros, how much we have to take 2 zero? This is the easy following. So, this is the approximate fraction of this question. Thank you. So, next question. The descending order of precision among the following. We have already studied the general introduction of Congo survey, uh, chain survey, theodolite, everything. At that time, I totally given you the definitions as per the precision. So, what is the first one here? So, this is based on micro optical theodolite, is the first one. Then, theodolite have the high precision. Then, Congo, then last only chain. They asked descending order. Okay, so carefully listen. Maybe in the other question, they might be asking ascending order. At that time, you have to write in the reverse order. Every time, think that chain has the least precision, then compass, then theodolite, then micro optic theodolite. Next question. Surveyor measured the area 50 meter square drawn to a scale of 1 centimeter by 1 meter. Later, he found that he, he used the wrong scale of this. So, correct scale is already given as 1 centimeter is to 1 meter means 1 by 100. Now, they said the area is given, measured area is given 50 meter square. Now, they said a wrong scale they used, wrong scale they used to 1 centimeter by 2 meter. That is 1 by 200. So, what is the correct area they want to find. So, how we will find what is the correct area already we discussed just before also. Wrong scale by correct scale, the whole square into measured area. So, what is wrong scale? 1 by 200 by what is correct scale? 1 by 100, the whole square into 50. Already this 100 and out of this it will cancel out and you will get 1 by 2 square. Okay, so what is 1 by 2 square? That is 1 by 4 into 50. When you cancel out, you will get the answer 12.5 meter square. So what is the answer of this 12.5 meter square? Next, we have to uh, discuss regarding types of maps and its scale. What is this actually? This is most important MCQ question. It can be asked in the examination. For example, they will ask you what is the map for the, what is the ratio, what is the scale for geographical map they will ask. So, 
it is 1 cm is equal to 160 km. As it is a wide area, we are using the very large measurement for geographical map only. Then location map. Location map, it can, it can be small, 5 to 25 meter only. Then cadastral map, 10 to 50 meter. Everything related with 1 cm. Okay, so you have to study this by heart. So uh, you can utilize the first uh, letter of this word, G, L, C, B, like this, if you want to by heart, like because I use that method, that is why I have made it bold letter. Building, you, we use 10 meter. Then rails and roads, 10 to 60 meter. Then topographical map, as it is a slight larger, 2.5 kilometer. Then forest map, it is 0.25 kilometer. Then town planning, 50 to 100 meter. Then the last were mines. Mines is 10 to 25 meters. So this is actually the related with the MCQ question. So just by heart it clearly. And thank you for watching my video. And for the next video, we will be discussing the conventional signs, then precision and accuracy difference. Then further the balance in CQs we will be discussing. Then true length, strong factor, some problems related and uh, representative fraction problems also we will be discussing in our next video. So please like if you have liked my video now and if you want to get the updation of the next videos, please click the bell icon nearby my subscription and please subscribe my channel if you like it. Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Bye. <laughs>